Hey everybody, welcome back. We are doing really well in this holy war. We might actually be taking Leon. So, uh, my war with them is this one. Yeah, holy war with Leon. War score is in our favor due to occupation. We haven't had a single major uh, battle with them yet, but we have some allies in the north up here who likely aren't backing us up at all because they're busy with their own war. And we're sieging down Leon, which we're trying to take these two counties here because they are part of the uh, Duchy of Leon. So we're going to get a lot more occupation score out of occupying this stuff, which is why we're currently sieging down the two mosques in it. And our enemies here are so busy with their rebellion. We just have to hope that their rebellion takes a long ass time to, re to resolve itself. Until then, we're building up money in case we need mercenaries. All right. Oh, we don't have a court physician. Oh, crap. Yeah. Um, recruit court physician. Don't want to get horrible wounds. That'd be really bad. Ooh, that's a big army there. It's part of the revolt. Okay, so they probably won't bother with me. No, this is the witch one. There's a chance of getting an infection. I could die from that. Now would be a horrible time to die. Um, I want a physician. A 28 skill. Oh my god, I forgot I had you. You're a physician. There, we've got a physician. Transfer vassal contract. Okay, yeah, I don't... That's fine. It was just informing me that because uh, the, the Umayyad um, Sultan is a person of interest. All right, my war is going good. I've almost sieged down one of the mosques. Keep has been built. Good. I think I want to save the money right now, so I'm not going to get another thing building right away. But hey, that'll be more troops. And they're trying to attack one of my provinces. It looks like they're getting back up in it too, so I'm actually going to have to go deal with that. Yeah, I'm going to have to actually go deal with that. Uh, what are we at? We're at 25% war score. That's good. So we'll go fight them, and then we'll come back. We'll annihilate them. Massacred. That was one of the mini wars being done against me, this one right here. So it's not it's not going to give me any war score towards the main war. What's this? Uh, the Austrian war has ended in white peace. Good. Because that means that the... Uh, I, well, I call them Austrian. The Austrias or whatever... They are, again, I'm never going to get the fucking name right. The French War. The French are going to come back us up now because they're not busy with other wars now. What's this? Righteous imprisonment on you. You're trying to murder. Oh. Uh, isn't that one of my family members? Cousin and son. Wait, someone's trying to murder my son? Oh, the second. I don't care as much about him. And I can't tell him to fuck off. I could invite him to my cart, which would be bad. Uh, but yeah, don't don't kill my cousin. Why would you kill my cousin? Go away. Actually, uh, only one dollar. I was gonna say I could imprison her to get the money, you know, banish her. But uh, no. All right, on troops, we're doing good. Okay, just making sure because we got that keep and everything. Good, she's getting away or putting away her murder plot, and we are still sieging. Now I don't think we're passively getting war score yet. Normally, if you've completed your goal, then you'll be passively having yours go up. Um, so, like, the occupation of the land that you're trying to get. But I don't believe we've reached that quite yet. See if word that... Oh, he's angry that um, I've been spreading lies about him. And they've killed my counselor. That's fine. We just get a new one. Oh, we do not have a good backup. I want join court. Yes. Uh... Oh god, there's like really no one great we could get, so I guess we'll take this guy. God, I just hope this, uh, I hope this whole revolt they're dealing with takes a long time to resolve. Keep sowing dissent. Keep them unhappy. Vassal levies raised too long. How many do we have that are vassal? Not many. Can I split off just the vassal ones? I can split off the retinue. Uh, if I were to put down the realm levies right now... Okay, they all return safely. That's fine. I'm fine with a little bit less troops right now if it keeps my vassals happy. And I'll just bring them back if I need them. Alright, that siege is done. We've completely sieged down that province. Now we start doing the other one, it's really gonna mess them up. We almost have this war done, too. Just off battles alone. In fact, are you willing to... No, I can't enforce demands on you yet. Enforce demands? What would that get us? 
uh, we would gain piety for more contribution. We gain a little bit of prestige. He had to lose some prestige. He pays me some money. And the money is almost a year's worth of ducats, considering I have my army raised. So that's not bad. I could use that money on mercenaries. Child education, my son, my fourth son. Oh, you're very good with stewardship, yeah. Raiders have arrived. I gotta deal with that. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, that sucks. Oh, these are pathetic armies. Um, put all of them down. God, I don't want to have to split my army. You're gonna arrive adjacent to me, and I'm a little worried they're actually gonna come after my province. I don't think they would, because why would they waste their own troops on fighting me when they're kind of going after the Umiyad itself? Um... Split in half, in half again. These guys will come up and deal with it. And the other two will merge together. So we're just splitting off about a third of our army to go deal with that. Great, even more raiders up there. Are they gonna join together? I think they're joining together, fuck. Um, in half, I can't split in half anymore than that. Um, Oh, this this could be bad. Of course this would happen now. Oh, okay, they actually are coming after me. They take till the 19th. Okay, well, I can beat them going to the next province, retreating back to here. Uh, their numbers are so overwhelming that even a river crossing wouldn't do us any good. Okay, no, they aren't combining together. Okay. They're running. That's fine. I just want them off my land. Dangerous place plots everywhere. Words have raised for me that someone wants to kill my son, Edward II. I know. Okay, we're gonna be pausing a lot. Yeah, they're coming after me. Let's go back into our land and they'll hopefully leave us alone, but they might break our siege on that, which would hurt our score. Do you know what? You guys pursue them. I wanna get rid of that second holy war. Oh God, they actually reached us? Holy shit, that's bad. We're gonna lose some troops there. Raiders, come on. Okay, good. Raiders are fighting them. Okay, you. Uh, what is your land? That right there. Mess it up. Please don't let a commander die. We got- we lost some money in loot. Great. And that's pillaged, so we get less out of it for a while. And even more have arrived over there! Oh my god, this sucks. Where are you going? Okay, at least you're going to an, to somewhere in my land. Oh my god, they're actually coming into my land? Oh no, this is the Umyad's main army. Okay, I thought this was the rebellion. I was like, what the hell are they doing? Uh, oh god, that sucks. Oh, this is bad. Where the hell are my allies? East Francia, you wanna get over here? Oh god, we need the backup now. We were doing so well. I hope they go fuck off to go deal with the rebellion soon. Yeah, we're losing a lot of troops here. Yeah, scare off the raiders. Uh, some types some titles have been usurped, that's fine. Betrothed can marry. Yeah, sure. Okay, we still have rent news, good. We're paying the upkeep, yeah. God, we lost a, mon a lot of money in that. We have allies up here who still have not started shipping over. I could really use that backup. God, this war is going so good normally. Oh, wait, no, he's leaving. He's leaving to go deal with that, okay. Yeah, okay. Actually, you know what? Don't bring them yet. Uh, so distress, good. And I forgot, there's something I should have done before. Uh, train troops in the capital. That'll greatly increase the speed I'm getting my troops back and my max. Uh, inherited a county, that's fine. What is this? Uh, the marriage happened, good. Uh, declared war to revoke. Okay, so he's dealing with another war, good. I'm fighting him and I want him to deal with more wars. Okay, these guys are coming into my land? That's fine. 
The second they get here, I'm just gonna ambush them and end that little mini war. This will put them away. There we go. End this war. All right, now I just have the one war to deal with. Okay, um, we still have a complete siege on that, so my war score should be ticking up outside of the failed battle. What rate am I reinforcing? Not bad, but that's per month. Uh, if I just put down and raised up all my troops, I'd get the extra ones immediately. But not worth it right now. Uh, has been looted by... Okay. Oh god, it informs me of way too many things I don't care about when I have him set as a special interest. I'm gonna unset that. Which is imprisonment? Why? I could arrest you very easily. Why, though? Why would I arrest you? What what gives me righteous imprisonment on you? I wish you would just say right here what it is that gives me righteous imprisonment on her. Because she doesn't have a she doesn't have a plot. Yeah, she doesn't have a plot that I can see, so I don't know why I can righteously imprison her. Okay. The white peace just ended. Oh, God. Okay. And unfortunately, other people aren't joining the Holy War. See, this is the annoying thing is, people have been telling me in the comments to Holy War basically the whole game. This is what happens. If you don't take a good opportunity... Uh, we took a good opportunity, but I don't think it's going to pay off now. Uh, if we were to white peace, what do we lose? A tiny bit of piety and prestige. And if I were to surrender, I'd have to pay an insane amount of money. Um, I think we just want a white piece, because we can't win this now. Yeah, we're just gonna have to white piece. God, that sucks! Because there's no way we can beat them now. Their army's just too big. And even with mercenaries, we can't bolster it enough. But no other Christian nations are joining us, or Catholic nations, rather. It sucks. Later in the game, see, I think this is why people get confused. Later in the game, the Christian nations are stronger and they do crusades a lot. And so it's way easier to Holy War later in the game. We're really early in the game right now. I'm gonna white piece. God, that sucks to do. There we go. Man, that hurts. All right, uh, see Realm Prosper. You can go back, uh, you can organize the army later. Um, fabricate claims. I just want to take this land again. Yeah, probably. Do I have a truce with any of you? I don't believe so. Yeah, not looking like it. Uh, I will start to fabricate on you. Man, that sucks. We were really doing something eventful there too. All right, you can, uh, yeah, resign them. You don't need a commander right now. In fact, stay on, away from the coast for now. What is the power? What is this? Uh, spend money, prospers, organizing foundation. Okay. Yeah, scholars. This will increase uh, our rate of getting technology points. That is so worth it. All right, let that retinue renew. Man, that sucks. Cortair, fortune builder, that's good. Oh, that's so disappointing. We were doing so well, too. Guess we just keep expanding north end. Raiders have arrived. Ah, God, fuck off. Crush them. They'll probably run, but whatever. Oh, God, another war? East Frankia. God damn, I'm so sick of dealing with East Frankia. Oh, my God, another one? They're having another revolt. Training ground built. Okay. God, if I just held out, like, another month, another rebellion would have happened. I couldn't have possibly predicted that, though. And I have a truce with you now, don't I? I, I can't even, yeah. Getting stressed. God, I'm stressed in real life from this shit. Yeah, it'd be a truce breaker. Okay. Fuck that. We're expanding north. Um, 
We could always be, uh, get tributaries, yeah. The problem with scooping up a bunch of these guys' tributary states is I wouldn't own them. I'd love to just start going crazy through here with tributaries. I mean, I'm way stronger than Scotland, although Scotland's tribal, so they'll have tribal allies, which might amount to a lot. I'm stronger than any power here in, uh, in England. Yeah. I could take any of the powers in England. I want to just conquer them, though, you know? But I could mass up a lot of tributaries. Then they pay me tax, and they pay me an amount of troops, and they need to join my wars, but I also need to defend them, which isn't a big deal. I, I don't think anyone would declare on them, considering how big of a country they have backing them. Uh, uh, appoint one of her male friends. Uh, oh, what is this? Oh, replace my steward. It's our son that's the steward. Who, wait, one of her male friends is my other son? Are you kidding me? Uh... Oh, God. This sucks. Um, the second, how good is the third? Because he's the heir, isn't he? He's not as good. No, I, I don't care if this upsets you. There, it barely even upset you. Have some money. There you go. We're fine. And, uh... Okay, retinue's already coming back at full speed. Got it. Go back to organizing the army. Man. Ah, oh, God. They're, they've blobbed out so much. And yet, I still make more money than them. Alright, I gotta come help them with their war, don't I? Yeah. Okay. Have these guys go up there and help them. And we'll go back to max speed. So investment workshop, right, because that can make us a net game of gain of money. We're still business focused, aren't we? Yeah, we could change that if we want. Ah, uh, do we want to? I think I might. I could always do my five years as a scholar and get the technology and military. Um, business just is not... It, it's a really good one. It's not bad. I'll stick on business a bit longer. Oh god, they just bolstered their numbers. Oh, this is rough. Um... Why are your guys all over the map? They must be in other wars as well. If we could all gang up, we'd be fine. Who are you? Catholic Uprising. Yeah, well, I don't want to fuck with you then, because you're on our side. No, 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 no. Oh, God, no, that is not the path I want to go game. Where are our troops? They're going down... What? Oh, they're also at war down there? All right, I'll go down there. Wait, are we just at war with... No, we're at war with some guy in the Umyad who happens to have a shitload of land, but he's not the leader. He just has tons of titles. I'll go mess with these. Oh God, I'll deal with the raiders while I'm coming through. Technology... Economic, I believe, is what I got there. Okay, go down there. Yep, set up the, uh, spend more money on the workshop, that's fine. Yeah, we'll raid that, that'll be fine. So someone was telling me, uh, during a stream today, that apparently, and they're not sure if this is their mod or not, apparently if you have a fort, in a county, it'll reduce the price of building a castle. I don't know what sense that makes, but I will give it a try. 
So we're just gonna experiment. So it cost me 18 ducats to make a fort. To make a castle here, it'd be 746 gold. So we'll see if the price goes down after this is built. So we'll see if it's less than 746. Okay, and to make sure it's refreshed, yeah, yeah. Uh, it lowered the price of the castle slightly. That is very strange. I don't know why that lowered the price. Upon construction of a new holding, the fort in this county will be removed and contribute a discount to the construction cost. That is very, very strange. I wonder why that is a thing. Huh. I forgot, we can't upgrade this, can we? No. Not unless we get next level construction, which we don't have yet. It's very strange. Yeah, forts can be built in counties that you control, as well as in hostile provinces that you occupy. Yep. Lockdown, uh, occupation of empty nomad provinces. I've never found them to be amazingly useful. I think they help you a little bit with coastal raiding, so maybe I want to drop some money and just build them all along the coast. Honestly, I've got the cash. So we're just going to do that. We have forts going up all along the coast. And we actually want to upgrade our places more. Uh, barracks, yeah. No, I'm not selling land. We've seen that one a thousand times. Oh, and you're upgraded, so put you on the coast. I don't know why... I don't want you guys there. You're wasting time there. Um, You want to marry Cortair? That's fine. Let's hope we get some money out of this. And random technology. I think we got military that time. We're not far off the next level of military, military organization. Uh, you want me to help you kill a kinswoman? No. <laughs> God, why would you even ask? I'm not a kinslayer. That was my predecessor. All right, got a little bit of money out of that. Did I, how much I contribute for that? Where am I? On this? I'm sorry. You've contributed nothing! I've contributed almost everything- Okay, no, it's like me and this guy have contributed basically everything to your stupid war for you. God. Alright, well, I'll contribute some more. Do the usual thing. Get the money and the prestige, and we might lose the prestige later. But whatever. We got money. That's what I care about. In fact, let's upgrade more. Now that we've got some more money. Get that cavalry to be really powerful. Actually, I used a little more money there than I probably should have, but we'll be fine. Uh, my grandson. Uh, struggle, because you could become, uh, you could become brawny, which is really good. Although you could also become dull, which is really bad. Rowdy's one of those ones that could be really good or really bad. Uh, my son, the fourth. He's not my heir. Yeah, he can learn on his own. Mm, they're done their rebellions. So they're probably gonna throw a lot more at us now. I'll just run if anything shows up. Oh, hey, look, another rebellion. A much smaller one this time. Deal with that. I'm sure you can handle it. Yeah. They have a bit of losses, but uh, my troops are much better than theirs. They're probably using mostly light infantry. Nice. Oh, it's doing a sound effect glitch where the sound effects are really quiet again. It's weird whenever that happens. Oh, and they're back. Okay, we sieged again. Nice. Man, I'm so disappointed that war didn't go better. It was We were really rocking it for a while. If I had known that another rebellion was just about to start that was just as strong, we might have been able to ride it out. That or if they didn't attack us. They were just too busy with what they were already doing. But I will say to my son, the fourth? He's 15, yeah. I hope he got good treatment. Did he? He got successful treatment, okay. Okay, yeah, this was, um... 
that was another one of those uh, workshop bonuses. I'm happy with that. Got my money back, and there's a tax increase in that city. Your physician uh, says I should buy him a book on anatomy. Well, that's pretty cheap, yeah. I mean, if it helps my physician, that's pretty important. I'm thinking it's time I finally get this level of construction. Let's do it. It's pretty cheap. Some of the sound effects are still quiet. It's so weird. All right. So we need a sick house before we're allowed to get leper colony or soup kitchen. Sick house is just more hospital level and disease resistance. Okay. I'll wait a little bit and then get that building. I do want a really good hospital in our capital to make sure that the family isn't dying of disease. Because, you know, when a plague rolls on through, if we're perfectly fine, that's not so bad. Because other people might be thrown into chaos from dying. Whereas us, uh, you know, lose some tax and everything, lose some levies. Gain one learning. That's awesome. Oh, nice. We have a siege leader now. We finally have a siege leader. That would have helped us so much in that war. Being able to siege things faster so we're wasting less time. All right. We have fully sieged down that province. That war is actually going quite well. All right. Keep sieging. Not making a move. Nope. It's going to keep fighting the good fight. They landed right on you, which means that they have that horrible amphibious landing penalty, and they have just about no morale. Yeah, immediately drove them off. They had no time to loot the capital, which is booming in prosperity, which is awesome. Man, we never get that, uh, let's see the realm prosper, have peace for 10 years thing anymore. Sucks, we never get that anymore because we're almost always getting called into wars. At least it means this is an eventful playthrough. Everybody's been telling me they've been loving watching this, which I'm really happy about because I'm loving playing it. Uh, I don't want to risk him dying, so... Cavalry leader, there we go. You're perfect for this. Siege done, good. We hit him, nice. Fortune builder. The fourth is a fortune builder, that's awesome. Truces are expiring, nice. Really hoping to attack them soon, that'd be fun annihilated them. And I could ransom you for 10 gold. May as well. Did this war end already? Uh, who died? Mother-in-law. Okay. And what did we do? Lose a big battle? No, we won a big battle. Weird. Our war score went down. They must have broken the siege. Because the places I'm sieging are not the war goals, so... Are you actually coming through my land? I think they're... I think they are, uh, raiders. Who are just trying to get back to their boat. That's another victory. More raider... God, these raiders are just incessant. This retinue is awesome. Alright, I think now is a good time to end this episode. Next episode, hopefully we do some more in Ireland. I'd really like to start moving through, and maybe I do need to just start making tributaries for quick strength. But I really want to just conquer them, you know? All right. Until next time, have a nice day.